Hey everyone, welcome back to Styrene Relics. Uh, boy, it's been a, a, a busy week, week and a half. I, I've not done a whole lot of building, but I did get some some done. Well, painting done, I, I should say. I didn't get much building done. Um, I, I have been working on my T-Bird. Uh, it's a two-tone interior with three colors. <laughs> figure that actually four colors uh it's a two-tone interior but uh what i'm saying getting at is the door card that's going to have the white bottom and then the middle piece is going to be uh the lime green but then <clears throat> the top piece has got to be the body color you know because that's the part where your re arm rests up on so well it'll be over here but yeah so Anyways, I got a, I got one color, two color, and then I got to shoot this in gold. Well, let me do this. One color, and then two color, and then I got to shoot the top piece in gold. And when that dries, then I got to shoot it over with that translucent uh, blue, and that'll turn it to green. So I got, you know, a lot of masking off to do, and then all this has got to get shot that body color as well. So a lot of ma a lot of masking, boy, I am messing that up. All this down in here and here, that's all got to get done. Then my problem is that is done in rattle can enamel. <laughs> so you know you're gonna have to wait for that to dry and dry and dry and dry, and then when it finally dries, then you can tape it off. Then you spray it again. Then you gotta wait for it to dry and dry and dry. So yeah, I should have never started that with that color but I did and then I got my doors I got my doors cut and the back sides put on them uh what I'll have is a, a spear coming out of the center here coming into there so that'll look pretty cool uh so I gotta get those painted uh I kind of got both of them done now uh I goofed painted the, I'd never have done that before <laughs> painted the body without the doors on it can't believe I did that, but so now I got to try and match that paint up. Uh, I got my seats done. They're in that off white. Now I got to uh, mask off the centers and I'm going to paint the outside piece around here. It'll be that lime green. So we'll try and get that done. Um, so yeah, this, this is coming along nicely. Uh, I shot my trailer and then in right in the middle of shooting my trailer my dog comes in and she starts shaking and got a big old dog hair in it and when i pulled it out it, it peeled the paint real bad so i'm gonna have to sand this down and redo this fender so now yeah, not a big deal she's a good girl so i got that to, to contend with uh let's see what else we got going on uh I did something I've never done before. I voted early. So, guys, uh, do whatever you need to do, but uh, get out and vote. All right, let's see. Um, here a while back, I was, uh, uh, a couple of Saturdays ago, I was uh, talking about, um, <clears throat> Kitty just knocked over something. I was talking about uh, my Wild Willie Borscht uh, fuel altered. And uh, Sean, down at the Mal Car guy, uh, he, uh, he said he wanted one of those because I had a couple extra ones. And I said, well, sure. He said, well, work out a trade. And uh, he said, what you after? And I said, well, I'm looking for a 67 vet, uh, kind of like that streaker vet and all those. Uh, I've got one uh, I'm going to build, but I was kind of wanting to do yet another one. And he said he didn't have one, but he had a, had a 57. So uh, I know you guys have seen this because he showed it a, a time or two. It's pretty cool. I built a couple of these already, but um, so yeah, it's it's got the really sweet wheels on it. I like those a ton. And, uh, you know, it's the gasser vet. 
So the wheels are cut out on it real nice. So the body's in really great shape. Thank you very much, Sean. I do appreciate it. I mean, everything's there. Um, and he sent me in the instructions, instructions, both of them. So, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, I do appreciate it, Sean. This is uh, pretty, pretty neat. Um, not sure how I'm going to build it just yet, but uh, knowing that I've got both set of decals there makes it a lot easier. That's for sure, knowing how I'm going to do it. So, anyway, we, uh, I thought we agreed on swapping out. I was thinking even up. But, look what he did. Nope, that ain't going to work. Yeah, Malcolm Smith on his Husqvarna. How cool is that? Seriously, how cool is that? I mean, now it's been started. It's not a big deal, but man, this was the guy. Back in the day, this was the guy, man. He ran flat track. He ran TTs. He ran trials, motocross. I, I all kinds of stuff. I mean, hill climb. The guy, and he wasn't just there to uh, participate. He was winning. <laughs> The guy would, he was just a master of everything you could think of. So, yeah, he's always been one of my favorites. So, yeah, thank you so much, Sean. This is, this is so cool. Now, I, now I've got this one, the Husky, and, uh, I got a, a 250 Yamaha. Uh, so, super, super cool. I'm, I'm, I'm digging this, man. This is, I was not expecting this. So, this is the 400 motocross. Yeah, all right. So, yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, guys, I appreciate everyone stopping by. Thank you so much, Sean, again. Uh, if you haven't got one of my shop cards and you kind of want one of these, uh, you know, they, they're great for throwing darts. Okay? You just stick it on your drywall and you start throwing darts. And you don't even have to take this down because this will hide all the holes behind the drywall, behind the card in the drywall. See, I'm looking out for you guys. Shoot me an email right here. I'll leave it down whoop, right here. I'll leave it in the description as well. And uh, if you guys are first time watchers, join up. Man, it's free. I don't care. I don't charge anybody. Never will, never have, as Sean would say. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I've been a little busy today. Got it, uh, kind of getting the yard picked up for winter, and uh, so maybe I get back in here this afternoon and start working on a model kit. All right, guys, I will talk at you later. Bye bye.